What's up, Better Days? Today we're on the Murfreesboro Greenway. This is the Broad Street Trailhead right off of the main route through town. And it's right in the parking lot with 84 lumber. It's 100 degrees today, literally. Not the heat index, the actual temperature. Today, for the whole next week, I'm gonna go jump in this river. I've never done this on this channel before. I've kayaked it and I've fished it from the bank, but let's go get in it and see what we can do. About a tenth of a mile away from Broad Street Trailhead, uh, downstream so on the other side of the bridge you come north on the trail on the greenway which is downstream on the river look there's a nice little path right here somebody has carved out through the woods it goes right down to the water's edge looks like we can hop in here oh yeah real nice let's just jump right in Wow. Okay. I have on a little floating jointed minnow. Real shallow water here. Which is what I expected. Ah, oh, feels good. It's cold and clear. That's pretty good. I've got on this little jointed minnow, but I think I might have better luck with the rooster tail. Let's see if we can have a little better luck with the rooster tail. It's going to spin my line all up, but that's okay. Part of fishing with the rooster tail. Oh man, look at this. Water. Golly, this is nice. I'll sit down in it. Ooh, there's a little pool right there. Oh, got a bite in there. Got our first hit of the day. Oh, I'm in knee deep water in the shade in Murfreesboro. Fishing white water. You guys absolutely have to come out here and do this. Oh, there we go, pig. Oh man, he smashed. He didn't get stuck though. That was a good fish. We're gonna catch some fish. There we go, first fish of the day. Long ear sunfish. Nice. That's why I went to that rooster tail because it catches so many tiny little fish. This is a 1 8 ounce white rooster tail with a silver blade. That's a good little fish, but we want a smallmouth. Oh, that 
Aaron just got something straight out there at the tip, straight in the center of the shot. Oh wow, it's splashing. There's a large mouth splashing over there. I see it, or maybe a smolly. Look at this. We're just gonna jump off in here. There is definitely a bass chasing stuff up on that flat over there. I saw the bass splashing. Okay, time to take the plunge. We're jumping in with all this current. We're just gonna jump in and run down, ride, ride it down through here. <laughs> There we go. That's not quite waist deep. Awesome. Man, this is fun. I need to do this more often. Am I catching a bunch of fish? No, not really. Am I having one heck of a good time? God, absolutely. You better believe it. Got one. I got one, guys. I got one. My first bass of the day. Ha ha ha! Target species acquired. Am I having fun or what? Man, how are you going to get all three hooks in your mouth? Oh my goodness. Two of them are out. There we go. All right. Look at the pattern on this guy. Look at the diamonds right there. Diamond, diamond. Golly, that's cool. Man, that's cool. All right. He hit that rooster tail up in this current up here. I mean, as soon as I threw it in, he was on it. Maybe there's another one in there, a bigger one. Oh, there's a big one. I just watched him take it. Oh, he got away. I watched him take it. I watched him come out from under the rocks and smash it. Darn. Man, I watched him just womp. Smash. Oh, just like that. Just like that. That's what I watched that smallmouth do, except the smallmouth was big. Man, let's get our hand wet. This guy's got all three hooks, too. They're really really hitting it good today <laughs> oh, God. man he's beautiful man this is awesome on a hundred degree day just awesome. Ah, this is awesome.
Oh, there's a good one. There's a bass. He was right in that V up there in front of us. All right. These smallmouth bass love to sit in that current. They just love current so much. Come on, buddy. I love you so much. I don't want to hurt you. Come on, buddy. There we go. All right. See that V right there in front of us? I just cast it right into the center of it, and that's where he came from. Look at that guy. No. There we go. That's a fish right there. That's the best fish of the day. Wow. He was sitting right up on that grass flat. Darn, that's a good bass. He's got some fight in him. Oh, he's being chased up by a bigger one. He got chased the whole way by a bigger one. There we go. Now we're catching some fish. And I told you, they're getting all three hooks pretty much every time. Huh. There we go. That's our best fish of the day. He was awesome. Heck of a fight. Jumped right out of the river. There we go. Got him. Right out of this rapids. Man, this is fun. That's a long ear. Look at how beautiful though. <sighs> Finally a fish with one hook in it. Oh, and it came out easily. Look where we're standing. Look at this. There's the bridge up there where I, I parked my car. Here's the rapids and here's a fish. So much fun. Got him. I knew it would. Bam. Tiniest fish in the river. But we love him. Well, he got stuck. There he is. Wow. So much fun. He looks like a little lure. walk through this crazy rapids. These are crazy rapids. Woohoo! If I was in my boat, I'd be all puckered up. There we go. All right, the um, Ned rig is just floating out here. I can't get it to go down, so let's try to use this um, crankbait. I know there's a big smiley in here, I saw him. Got one, good one. It took me a while. I had to make five or six casts right here with this crankbait, but this is the biggest bass of the day right here. 
It's like a rock bass. Oh yeah, big fish of the day is a rock bass. Heck yeah. Good one too. There we go. Oh, he's got a chunk missing. Cool guy. Hit my crankbait. There we go. That's a good fish. That's a heck of a big old fish, you guys. Look at him trying to get back in that grass. I ain't gonna let him. Golly. That's a good fish. That's what we came out here for. Big old largemouth. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Big fish of the day is now a largemouth bass. So we've caught largemouth, smallmouth, rock bass, long-eared sunfish, just walking around. That's Stones River Country Club right there. Just right next to, let's see, what hole is that? Three, four, this is hole, this is the green at hole number five. And here's a largemouth bass. <laughs> he ran right into my leg. Oh, he's in between my legs. <laughs> All right, that was amazing. I just wanted to come out in the middle of the day, right at lunchtime, right at noon, and just beat the heat. And we were able to do that. Look at this. This is beautiful. And this is just right, I, you can actually see in the distance there, Broad Street, the car's passing. We're right down from where we put, we're right down from where we parked and just hop in the river and enjoy. I tell people where to go fishing. Sometimes it's a good place to beat the heat. If you like that kind of thing, consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a better day.